everybody welcome to my channel and welcome to my office if you are new to my channel my name is Tony I am a full-time gig worker and a mom and I take you guys along with me as I work through the gig economy with all these different gig apps and I try to show you guys the ins the outs the good the bad and everything in between we stay positive we set goals we try to crush those goals and help one another in making that money honey so if that sounds like something that you might be interested in definitely like this video and subscribe I would really appreciate it so I'm gonna go over what happened to me on Sunday. I wasn't gonna record on Sunday. Um, it was like a day off, but I ended up getting a shop and deliver order, which had just recently launched in my area through Walmart Spark and I had never done one and they're new. So I don't think anyone's ever done one and I'm sure everybody was just as curious as I was to see what it was all about. So that's what I'm gonna show you in the next videos to come. But before we get to that, I wanted to go over my earnings from Sunday. So I worked six and a half hours on Sunday with Walmart Spark, Uber Eats, and Amazon Flex. Most of my earnings were through Walmart Spark. I did $18.50 for one delivery through Amazon. I did one delivery through Uber Eats and made $13.22. And for Walmart Spark, I made $158.50. And four of those were the shop and deliver orders absolutely amazing if you guys get offered shop and delivers I think they're worth it but watch this video and let me know what you think I was not gonna record a video today but I just got my very first shop and deliver order through Walmart spark so I'm super excited about this and I just want to show you guys what it's all about because I don't even know what it's all about I'm on my way right now to the store um, it says to start shopping by 10 16 it's 9 50 I want to start shopping earlier because I'm not quite 100% sure of what I'm doing I got 16 items it was offering me $22 and four cents and it says it's a three mile trip from the store to the customer and it needs to be delivered by 11.23. We've got plenty of time. Uh, I know we can make this work. So come on, let's go shop and deliver with Spark. Before I go into the store, I'm going to preview the list. So this is the list of items that the customer wants. Alright, let's start shopping. This is the first item they gave me. So they only had half of what the customer wants, so here I'm adding a substitute. They didn't have the item the customer wanted, so it gave me a substitute.
This is my last item and it gave me a warning that my time is almost up. With this cheese, I first scanned the wrong item. So it's kind of cool that it tells you you have the wrong item until you actually scan the correct item, which I did eventually find. Now that we're done shopping, I just head to the self-checkout and I scan the UPC code that is on the register and then an associate will come over and check the items while I bag them. And then I'm done. Well, that wasn't as exciting as I thought it was going to be. <laughs> First of all, I forgot how ridiculously annoying and busy Walmart is and how much I hate shopping at Walmart. <laughs> Putting that aside, um, I liked the way that it showed you exactly what aisle to go to and the section. Now, I didn't understand what the sections meant until I asked somebody. So I will show you this little picture right here, just a screenshot of what the label looks like, okay? And the first number is the actual section. And the number with a letter over it is the actual aisle. And um, they time you. So I will show you another screenshot of the, the screen that I'm looking at. And the top left, the black circle, is how much time you have left. And the red circle is how many items you have left to shop for. At one point, it told me I only had five minutes left, so it gave me a five minute warning. Uh, what I don't like is you have to go in the order that they tell you to. I tried to like get out and change to skip to a different item, and it wouldn't let me. So for one of the items that they didn't have, it gave me the um, replacement to choose. But for one of the items, it was the minced garlic, they, it was, they wanted minced garlic in vegetable oil and they wanted six cans of it or whatever. They only had three left. So it told me to choose a substitute. So they did have the minced garlic in water. So um, I was able to choose that as a substitute for the other three and move on. I hope it's right. Um, like I said, this is my very first time doing this and the shopping and delivering through Spark is very new in my area. It just started like a week ago. So not only am I going to get paid, you know, what the base pay and hopefully the tip if they don't change it. I'm also getting, I think, an extra $15 just for doing my very first one. And I am added into a... Um, bonus to you complete so many and you get this much so yay i completed my very first shopping and delivery through spark and uh, i'm on my way to drop it off the customer's eight minutes away um i definitely need some refreshing but uh we made it we made it through and um there's my husband now we made it through and we are ready for the next like I said I don't know if it's something that I would want to do all the time maybe when it's slow not on the weekend because just Walmart's so crazy and even for myself like I hate shopping at Walmart like I absolutely hate shopping at Walmart and um yeah <laughs> it's annoying <laughs> that's why we order online to have somebody do it for us anyways all right let me know if you guys have any questions or if you've done a shopping and delivering order through spark yourself and you know you have some tips for me i would love to see them below um i tried to show you guys as much as i could while still trying to get it done within a good time frame and you know the last thing i want to do is be late 
and at, for a minute there I thought I was going to be late when I got my five minute warning but come to find out I only had the item in front of me left to shop so all right I am gonna pull up to the customer's house in two minutes it is a contact free delivery and uh, let's do this wanted to film this right now just to show you my very first shop and delivery order so that's what this whole video is entire video is all about so I will see you guys in the next video it is Sunday so I am out here making that money honey and I suggest that you do the same thing too stay safe peace out